Good morning, it's Monday, September 23rd, and today we are going to address the questions surrounding the buyer slash seller compensation conversation. This is your market in a minute, so start the clock. The headlines say the sellers no longer need to pay the buyer's realtor, and I want to tell you they never did. Consider this, the buyers always paid the commissions, both the buyer's agent's commission and the seller's agent's commission. You see, the buyer paid the seller a certain amount of money that would allow the seller to net after their cost, which includes commissions, a number that was acceptable to the seller. So the buyer paid for the home, the amount the seller wanted, and for the commissions, both commissions, in the price they paid. The seller then paid their listing broker who then divided up the money to the cooperating agents. Buyers, you always paid for your agent's compensation, but you were able to finance it, which is really why this is so hard to swallow. Now you're being asked to pay it out of your pocket and at closing, and I get it. That is going to be hard for some. And let me remind you, you will sign an agreement to pay the agent representing you even if they are the listing agent. It's required by law. And since the buyer side requires so much more work, the listing agent now representing the buyer will charge a buyer's agent's fee. Now, all of this is very new, and I believe we will find that those that offer compensation will sell faster and for more money than those that do not. And in a year, we will be back to where we were before. And one last thing to consider, if a seller is creating negative hurdles before you've even seen the home, what other negative hurdles will you run into in the future with that person? If you have any questions about what's going on in the Vero Beach real estate market, about a particular neighborhood or a specific property, feel free to reach out to me. I'm Trip Hernandez with Dale Sorensen Real Estate in Vero Beach, Florida. Thank you for watching and have a great week.